How you doing guys, Stevie here. Uh, today I'm going to be trying the Peach Hedgehog. The uh, Hedgehog I was using the other day. The other guy requested it in one of the comments on that fishing video. So, we'll get started. So on the vise I've got the uh, Vario wet fly hook. This is a size 10 just for the video purposes. Uh, it's barbless. But use them 10s and 12s anyway. But the one I used in the video was a 12. But the, the thread I'll be using is Unithread. A O in red. So I'll run a bit of thread down the hook. And then just take it right down to the bend. And cut off the waist. There's a couple of thumbs just to cover that up. And for the tail, there's a tail in this one. You can, the tail's optional, you don't need to put a tail in them. Uh, this is glow bright, glow bright number five and number eight, which are velcroed together, eight strands of each. So, get the moisten and just tie this in. And just come back there the hook. And the length of the tail. It's optional again, it's up to yourself, but I just like it just longer than a tag, so maybe about three quarters length for the, the hook shank. Just drop my hook finish tool there. And for the body, what I've got is this Aurora Fire Dubbin. This is a Orkney Aurora the Fire. Which is glow bright floss just blended together, which is five and eight. I think there's something else in there, I'm not sure, but I get in the fly box to blend this for me. So I'll just take small pinches to start with. Just a small pinch. Just it's probably too much. Just I'll do it there. And for the wing, what you want is rodier, the darker the better. And just take a pinch of that. You don't want too much of a pinch because it starts spinning around the hook. And what I do is just take the fluff out the, the end of the hair. Stick it in the hair stacker. And get a tap. So, what I'll do first is re wax this thread. A couple of turns. And then just pull it any loose ends. And the length of the wing, what I do is like just, just meet the tail, the end of the tail. Start spreading it. And back in with the dubbing. And a small, small bunch, small piece. And just come back the way again, then go forward. And re wax your thread. Another piece of deer here. You just keep repeating this three or four times. So again you're just pulling all the, the fluff out and into the stacker and 
and just marry it up with the last wing. Just hold that tight. You don't want it spinning like a bubbler. Just tie them, tie that back in. Let's see if it's spinning. It's, it's not too bad. Then just back in the dubbing again. Just come back on the, the wing a bit. Should do it there. And same again, last bunch, three bunches, three bunches is enough. Fluff and then a stacker. I just marry up the, the, the last bunch again. Just cut off the waist. Sense. So what you could do is finish that off if you want, but what I've been putting in is three legs each side. Which is optional. Uh, I just like them trailing out the back. each side just natural not a pheasant tail or you could put dyed it in if you want it's up to yourself really what you want to do uh, just get them the correct length that's it Cut off the waist. And just to finish the fly off, what I, I had on the fly I was using the other day is a wee bit of a peach head. So just a wee bit more dubbing. That's it there. So this is a flyer. I, I do well with an opener. I didn't actually catch it the other day, but the last the time before that I was out I had quite a lot of fish on this. I had them on Harry Lock and I had a good day of handling with this fly, this very one. So what finish and just cut off the thread. A wee bit of varnish. And clean the eye. Just get a hook or something. It's lying around. Clean the eye. And that's it guys. So that's a peach hedgehog, an absolutely deadly fly. Four brown trout anywhere to be honest, you know what I mean, but it's particularly, it's a brilliant flying orkney. It, most of the locks up there, certainly Harry and Hunland, it's a great fly. So I hope you enjoyed that one, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.